So basically this is how the uh, Russian demilitarized KA-52 looks like. This is KA-52, marvel of Russian military engineering, the uh, helicopter that cannot be destroyed. Um, or so Russian advertisement says. Uh, as you see, it's kind of destroyed. Um, this one has been uh, shot down by Ukrainian conscripts in Hostomel. So this is kind of Russian flying tank. You see those two rotors, very specific for uh, KA-50 and KA-52. They are counter-rotating. That's why this uh, helicopter doesn't have that uh, sta stabilizing rotor in its tail. Um, so I literally found piece of its uh, armor. I don't know. Maybe because of uh, of uh, temperature, this armor doesn't doesn't look very um, kind of solid. This looks like a piece of its windshield. Uh, the glass is kind of thick. Here you can see its exhaust um, and these are the electronics. Oh, and here's something interesting. Uh, this looks like POH, uh, Pilot Operating Handbook for this aircraft, or what's left of it. And this is Russian electronics. You see that little mouse that died inside. Not sure whether it was there during the the, the crash, but yeah, um, it's unfortunate. Uh, apparently, this is famous Russian module. I think uh, those are infrared science uh, sites and uh, stuff like that. I'm not really familiar with uh, uh, with these kind of modules, um, but it's its uh, armor um, sucks, so to say. <laughs> you see, you see that uh, this armor uh, has a lot of holes from uh, from fragments or maybe bullets. Um, you can see how it looks like here. Basically, you can see these ashes here. Um, I literally wasn't able to find any armor or something that uh, more or less looks like armor in this helicopter. Uh, so, uh, for example, when you see a, a destroyed tank or uh, APC, uh, you see that it has a body armor and uh, nothing like this can be found uh, in this crash site.